huh, today we're going to return to a recurrent topic, and it's the topic of faith in public places, and we're going to discuss the issue of these two California Christian moms who've become embroiled in a federal civil lawsuit uh, with their school district over bricks. Now, I know that seems strange, but the Palm Desert uh, High School had a fundraising campaign in which uh, what you did was you got to buy a paver and you could put anything on the paver that you want. Well, apparently they hadn't thought this out. This is what the moms wanted to put in the papers for Bible verses. So when the um, sponsors, the PTO, the parent-teacher organization, discovered six pavers with Bible verses, uh, they called the principal and said that these uh, couldn't be accepted as part of the program. Well, you know, they thought there was a First Amendment problem. Problem is, they never told anyone that they wouldn't accept religious verses, and they had built a similar memorial walkway at another high school or another part of the high school previously, and that one had, for example, um, Hindu verses from Gandhi and some other religious verses. And embarrassingly enough, it, while rejecting the two mothers' uh, Bible verses in English, they accepted Bible verses in Spanish. I guess they didn't know what they were. Uh, so what happens? Uh, the mothers sue the school board claiming that they are discriminating on the basis of religion and that they are uh, engaging in unlawful censorship. Uh, the school district then uh, decides that they're going to give the $45,000 back and you know, not use any of the papers for the walkway at all. Apparently that approach may not work. It appears that the school, some experts say, created a limited public forum without any restrictions when they uh, invited people to express themselves in uh, putting uh, in, this, in this walkway. And they believe that Christians had every bit of a right to express themselves from the Bible with scriptural verses as anyone had to quote Hindu or Buddhist or any other, or any other uh, kind of verse. Uh, so it's before the federal uh, district court. It'll be interesting to watch. Uh, hopefully the, the parents will prevail. There is a growing uh, atmosphere of uh, kind of anti-religious, anti-Christian propaganda in much of the West. Uh, I think you may be familiar with a video uh, here on YouTube of a BBC program called the marginal on the marginalization of Christians in Britain, and then and one of the I think we discussed that before. Because one of the episodes they had was Christians in Britain who were being prosecuted by the anti-discrimination uh, authorities there because they had put up Christmas lights, or as perhaps they prefer to call them holiday lights, and the board thought that might offend Muslims. The fact is that we need to have a vigorous public square where people are free to express themselves and to share their beliefs uh, with their neighbors. That's what's the hallmark of a free society.